Hi, and welcome to the first of a series of demo videos in which we'll showcase the unique and intuitive capabilities of Vectra's user interface. In this video, I'll provide a tour of the host detections page, which is the default user interface page of the Vectra X Series platform. For more detailed information on how to use the various features that you'll see on this page, make sure to check out our additional demo videos. We'll begin by logging in. During the deployment of a Vectra X Series platform, the administrator will configure the login credentials to be used for access to your device. Successfully logging in will bring you to the host detections page. At the top, you'll see a control bar that will allow you to navigate to the All Detections page. You can also access statistic summary tools like highlights and health monitoring, or configure system settings, use resources, change the password, or log out. You'll see that the body of the page contains two tools that can be used to monitor detections. The first is a graph that plots hosts on a threat certainty index. The second is a list of these hosts. A solid point on the graph indicates that there was a single host with the threat and certainty scores for that location on the index. A hollow point indicates that there were multiple hosts with those scores. Clicking on a solid point opens a tooltip that provides more detailed host information. This includes the host's name, current IP address, the latest detections, the threat and certainty scores, and a timeline of the host's history of detection. Hosts that have both high threat and certainty scores are shown in red, orange, and yellow on the graph. These hosts pose the greatest potential risk for your organization. By default, hosts in the list are organized from most recent to least recent by the last seen column. Another way to organize hosts is to use the threat or certainty columns. If I want to see all hosts that were using a MacBook Pro, I might type in the search bar MB Pro. Vectra also allows you to tag hosts, but we'll cover this functionality in a separate demo. This concludes our introduction to the host detection page. For more information, we invite you to check out our additional demo videos, to download content from our website, or to request a live demo from a sales associate.